hi everyone welcome back thank you so much for watching this video i hope you all are well so obviously from the title you can tell that today i'm going to do a skincare haul i was actually supposed to film this video like three weeks ago but unfortunately i had a really bad like a viral sore throat as well as cough so i couldn't film the video and because i'm pregnant at the moment i was not allowed to have any medication apart from paracetamol but unfortunately paracetamol didn't work for me so finally after three weeks i have recovered and i'm back filming video so basically i've got all the skincare items right in front of me as you can see there, there are quite a few actually to be honest so I've got everything from face mask to um, serums face oil moisturizers etc so anyway I'm gonna take out all the items randomly and then talk about why I picked them up some of them are actually um, new products that I've never tried before but I had always wanted to try so finally I actually bought them so let's get into the video starting with the first item I have is actually this one here which is a drying mask from Mario Beduski and this one is great for problematic skin at the moment I've been getting like lots of acne and a little bit of redness as well so hence i really wanted to try this i've heard like a really really good review of this one so you apply that onto your problematic area and leave it for 20 minutes you can do this two to three times a week apparently it gets rid of acne and any skin problem you have so i'm looking forward to trying this one it does smell a little bit funny but i don't mind that so moving on to next one i have is actually a moisturizer so the first one is kit somerville's goat milk moisturizer which i really wanted to try for a long time but i never really did so finally i gave in and i've got it here with me now it is a very light moisturizer i've already used it this one um, is actually 50 ml i really like the packaging oh god the packaging is so good like i feel like this is very hygienic because normally the moisturizers like if, if it comes in a pot then you have to dip your finger in and get the moisturizer out so uh, some of the times it just leaves like a little bit dirt in the moisturizer so i don't really like that but this one you just push uh, this bit here and then the moisturizer comes out so i think it is very hygienic i think it's a brilliant packaging and then i picked up another moisturizer which i said to you earlier so it is this one here this one is a very basic one from nivea this one is 24 hour moisture boost this is a soothing night cream actually so basically because my skin is so sensitive i needed a night cream i ran out of night cream so i just thought i'll pick this up a very basic one this one is 15 ml the thing about my skin is that uh, sometimes it doesn't work like a lot of the products doesn't work for my skin because I've got very sensitive dry and rosacea acne prone skin so I really didn't want it to waste a lot of money on uh, night cream hence I just bought the basic one for this time I also picked up skincare gadget I'm a big fan of uh, skincare gadgets to be honest I really like to invest in them I've invested in few of them before like face brush and face massage like tools etc so this time i actually picked up a face massage tool um, which comes in a box like this i got this one from cult beauty i will link everything down below in the description box if you guys are interested obviously i'm not gonna make any money out of it but anyway i'm gonna leave the link down below so that it will be easier for you guys to show up so basically this is what it looks like uh, this is a jade roller which is overhyped at the moment but i absolutely love this one i've had this for four months maybe and four or five months maybe longer than that actually because i can't remember off top of my head right now but yeah i really like this it is so great um basically it has got this big roller on uh, one end and small roller at the other end which is for the eyes and this is for the entire face this stimulates like blood circulation great for um, acne scarring as well as well as it will reduce puffiness as well as inflammation which i am very prone to so hence i really really like this one you can keep this in the fridge and use this that way or you can either use this um, without keeping this in the fridge as normal so I really like to use cold I keep it in my fridge most of the time and 
Oh, the sensation you feel after you've done uh, this um, jade roller is just amazing. I also picked up chemical exfoliant, which is my favorite. I really, really love this one. But unfortunately, this is a little bit pricey. This is Dr. Dennis Gross Peel. So this is what it looks like. It has got five treatments in it. And I think I paid around... Uh, 15 quid or 16 quid something like that for this which is quite expensive so basically it comes in a like a little sachet let me take this out and show you so it has got like two sachet here one is for exfoliant second one is neutralizer so basically when you apply this for a few seconds it's it's gonna kind of like sting a little bit but then afterwards you just apply this neutralizer and then it balances everything out i really really love this one highly recommend this one i've been using this for long time now probably two three years but i have not fallen out of love with this one it is so amazing it does what it needs to do and i don't use any scrub to exfoliate my face anymore because i found that when i use like a physical um, scrubs then it actually makes my acne or my skin worse so hence i have resorted to chemical exfoliant which works really really well with my skin and also another thing about this chemical exfoliant is it just goes deep down inside the skin and gets rid of all the dead um, cells etc and it exfoliates really really well but with this scrub it only does the outer layer of your skin however with the chemical exfoliant it will go deep inside the skin and exfoliate really really well hence i'm a big fan of chemical exfoliant moving on to next bit let's go on to like serums and face oil um i don't usually use face oil these days i used to be a big fan of face oil i actually used to use mustard oil before my skin got worse but nowadays i avoided using face oil so this time because i'm pregnant my skin is getting dry so i just thought i'll try you know new uh, face oil which is highly highly recommend by one of the followers who normally comments on my video thank you so much to you for recommending me rose hip oil which is this one here oops i picked up the wrong product so it is this one here from Sukin. She recommended me to get the Sukin one rather than the ordinary one because she said the ordinary one is like very, very oily. Hence, I went for the Sukin one. This is an organic rosehip oil and this is 50 ml. Next one I have is Mabel and Meg um, Hyaluronic Acid plus Vitamin C Serum. It is this one here which was actually gifted to me by my sister-in-law she really raves about this product and she said like whenever she has a breakout when she uses this product it gets rid of all her problem skin so hence she recommended me this one and she actually got it this one for me so this has got vitamin c my skin can be like a little bit funny when it comes to vitamin c i've tried clinic vitamin c as well but unfortunately it broke me out really really bad it made my skin even more worse like redness and acne came out hopefully because this one is with hyaluronic acid i hope it will work for me because hyaluronic acid has got um, a lot of water retention it can retain a lot of water so i'm a big fan of hyaluronic acid and i think the mixture of vitamin c and hyaluronic acid is so interesting i also picked up face wash this time around i normally don't use face wash to be honest i only use like once a month i actually use cleansing milk i actually massage it really well and then use like a cotton pad to take makeup off or dirt off that is what i've been doing for a long time and it works well for my skin but i feel like some days i really wanted to you know use face wash to um basically clean my face <laughs> does that make sense so i really like that feeling of like soapy feeling of face wash so hence i picked up this one from la roche posay I am a big fan of La Roche Posay and especially this Sisa Plus range works really really well for my skin. It is great for problem skin. Um, this one just says it has got like antibacterial agents in it so it will get rid of a um, lot of like acne, redness etc. This is good for babies, children and adults. So um, if it's good for babies obviously it's going to be good for everybody basically. So yeah I am looking forward to trying this one as well. I know I've been saying like I've i'm looking for trying a lot of products but honestly yeah some of these products are uh, fairly new for me which i've actually never tried so yeah looking forward for uh, trying this one as well next is this one here which is actually not for skincare but it is for my um belly 
<laughs> for my bump actually so this one i've been using since 2016 during my first pregnancy basically this is for stretch marks this is palmer's cocoa butter formula one so i think in 2016 was the year they came out with this one and i had like a little sachet which was given to me so i tried that one i was using bio oil previously but then when i used this one i really really like it so bio oil is really good but it's kind of like an oil form but this one is kind of like a moisturizer form it has got vitamin e shea butter and collagen as well so i used this one and it really worked for my skin i didn't get any stretch marks so this time around as well in my second pregnancy i picked this up so that i could use this one and not have stretch marks so far i've actually not got stretch marks yet and hopefully it will be fine fingers crossed for that another item i actually picked up is a travel size estee lauder products and it is this one here um, I'll do a close-up shot of this one because it's like really tiny. Um, basically, this one is Advanced Night Repair, which I have been like serum, which I've been using for a long time, five, six years. It is amazing. I highly recommend this one. It just gets rid of your fine lines. It is basically really good. Like it makes your skin so smooth. So hence, um, you know, I just thought I'll pick this up. I've never tried their eye cream. The reason I actually picked this up is actually because of their eye repair cream and also it came with this eye mask which I really really wanted to try. This is an um, advanced night repair concrete recovery mask so this looks so interesting to me there is like a little eye mask on the top here it looks like a cotton i've never tried it and then there is a gel here you have to soak that eye mask into that gel so i'm looking forward to trying this one i've heard really really good reviews about this um, eye mask and like I said earlier, there's a repair eye cream as well in here. I really didn't want to spend money on a big jar in case if I didn't like it. So hence I thought I will go with travel size, try this. And if I really like it, I can pick up the bigger one. And there is also like a foaming cleansing face wash for a night. But I don't think I'm going to use this. Last one I have is a face mask sheet. Obviously, if you guys have been following me for a while, you know that I'm big fan of Korean like a face mask sheet because it works really well for my skin it doesn't break me out I had used Garnier one uh, before um, but unfortunately that broke me out really really bad so hence um, I've actually not tried many like a western ones to be honest I always stick to the Korean ones and my favorite from um, Korean range is actually this one here from Tony Molly so it is this one here this is a hyaluronic mask a sheet so i actually buy most of my korean items um, on amazon these days i used to shop with yes style but i've not done it for a while because the only thing i do not like about yes style is that their delivery is so slow it just takes sometimes a month to come through so amazon is much more quicker so hence i picked this up from amazon this one was a 10 pack i've already used i've only got like six left so 10 pack for 12.98 not bad i would say i've been using this one a lot i really like to use this mark sheet uh, and then massage my face with jet roller which works amazingly well i might actually do a separate video on how i actually use this jet roller please do let me know if you guys would be interested on that but anyway so yeah that's, this is the last item i bought and i really can't stop buying this mask honestly this doesn't break me out and uh, it just works so well for my skin basically so yeah hence i really really like it and i had to pick this up again so these are all the items i think i've covered everything let me check i don't want to miss out because sometimes when i'm showing you all the items i miss out a couple of the items but anyway yeah these are all the items i picked up this time and yeah thank you so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it i'll see you on my next one till then take care bye